Hello guys, welcome to Camax China. My name is Elvis. I'm the sales engineer from Camax Machinery. We're a professional manufacturer and supplier of oil press machine, oil refining machine, and other related equipment over 15 years. We have supported hundreds of clients to succeed in their oil making business, and we hope to be of your support too. Today I'm in the workshop. By my side is a 1,000 liters per batch oil refining plant. Please follow my camera to see more details of it, and I will explain how it works step by step. Thank you very much. It is a site of four tanks, full functional, batch type oil refining machine with electric heating method, with function of degumming, deacidification, dewatering, bleaching, and deodorization. It can be applied to 95% of oils on market. Now let's see what is the whole plant made of. The whole plant includes degumming tank, deacidification tank, dewatering and bleaching tank, deodorization tank, working platform with steps, control cabinet, addictive liquid tank, oil pumps, steam generator, vacuum pump, fatty acid trapper, and plate oil filter. By all the equipment mentioned, we can achieve full functional refining process. This is an integrated control cabinet. You can control all the electrical parts from here. Also with bilingual labels to help our clients to understand the function better. It has power indicators, emergency stop, volt and current meters, speed controllers to control the mixing speed. And from those buttons, we can start or stop the mixers, heaters, and pumps. Adopting chain brand electrical components all the cables and wires are protected by the insulation pipes and we use cable trunking to get all the wires and cables well organized and protected. Due to the quality difference of different oils, the following information is just for your reference. Gum stuff is phospholipids. It will affect the quality and shelf life of oil and generate a large amount of oil films during usage, which damages the experience of users in a bad way. So firstly, we pump the crude oil into the first tank through the oil pipelines, turn on the heating switch, and start mixing. After the oil is heated to 60 to 80 Celsius degree, add certain amount of hot salt water from the liquid addictive tank. The water temperature should be higher than the oil and mixing fast for 20 to 30 minutes and then stop and keep it still. Utilize the hydrophilicity of phospholipids. It absorbs water and expands and then sinks to the bottom of the tank. And we can discharge it through the bottom ball valve to achieve the purpose of degumming. After degumming, the oil will be transferred to the second tank for deacidification process. This is a chemical refining process, and free fatty acids can affect the quality, shelf life of the oil, and generates harmful substances to the human body. The operation method is similar to the first step of degumming. Turn on the heating switch and start mixing. After the oil is heated to 60 to 80 Celsius degree, add certain amount of hot alkaline water into the tank. The water temperature needs to be higher than the oil and mixes fast for 20 to 30 minutes. During this process, the neutralization forms saponified substances, which sink to the bottom of the tank. Then we can discharge it through the bottom ball valve to achieve the purpose of the acidification. After degumming and deacidification, the oil enters the third tank, and in this tank, Dehydration work is carried out first because the moisture will damage the absorbability of the decolorizer in the next step, thus affecting the decolorization performance. We will heat the oil temperature to 105 Celsius degrees. The water reaches the boiling point 
and the steam is extracted through the vacuum pump so as to achieve the purpose of dehydration. Then the decolorizing agent is put into the tank with mixing so that the decolorizing agent and the pigment in the oil are fully mixed and absorbed so as to complete the decolorizing function. After that, we need to cool the oil temperature down to 60 to 80 Celsius degree and then pump it out of the third tank into the plate filter in order to separate the decolorizing agent from the oil and the oil will be collected in the oil tank and then will be pumped into the first tank for the next deodorization purpose. The fourth tank is a deodorizing tank, which uses external heating, hot steam, and vacuum pump to create a high temperature and high vacuum environment. And water steam is injected into this distillation tank and the smelly substances in the cooking oil are removed by using the difference in the volatility of odors and the oil and the carrying effect of water steam so as to improve the quality and taste of cooking oil. In the meantime, it can further improve the FFA value as well. By these steps, the whole refining process are generally finished.